So hello and welcome back to another exciting video of class for computer and we are learning our ongoing lesson that is formatting text in open office writer and we have learned few things earlier of this lesson so we have learned about find and replace tool okay how to replace that particular word when you click on that binocular option you will get find and replace window and from that find and replace window you have to search a word that you want to replace with and then you have to type another word by which you have you want to replace so the same thing you can do in that particular same find and replace window itself so in that window or by that window we can replace one word at a time also and we can replace all words at a time also then we have learned bullets and numbering also so these are used to show you a text in the form of list or in the form of points so we have seen when we are using numbers that time you can use roman numbers alphabets then you can use some uh, symbols also as your uh, bullets okay so then we had learned about alignment also so four kinds of alignments are there left alignment center alignment right alignment and justify alignment and for all those alignments we have a keyboard shortcut okay for the center alignment we have control plus e shortcut for the right alignment we have control plus r shortcut for the left alignment we have control plus l shortcut for justify alignment we have control plus j as r shortcut so these are used to align your lines that we have already learned so this is the left alignment this is the center center alignment this is the right alignment and this is the justified alignment now we are going to learn about format paint brush option so what is this format paint brush option is so when we have applied some formatting to particular text like suppose humne kya kar diya kisi text ko bold italic or something kar diya and same we want for other text also kabhi kabhi ghar mein hota hai na when uh, your elder or your younger brother or sister has got something unhe kuch kapde ya fir koi khilona aisa de diya hai jo bahut acha hai and you want the same one aur agar aapko koi dusra diya jaye ya fir aapke brother ko aur sister ko koi dusra diya jaye so they start crying they want the same one only unhe kya hona chahiye same hi chahiye unhe same hi chahiye wo jis tarah se rona shuru karte so when please don't type anything over there spandan thank you okay so when you want the same formatting to that particular another option also that time you can use the paint toolbox also this is format toolbox so to know that we will go to our open office window and where what we will do here we will apply a formatting to particular word now what we will do this help word is there help word what we will do we will make it bold we will make it italic we will change its font color to pink okay and what else we can do now uh, we can uh, make it stripe through also okay so we have applied this kind of formatting to that particular word help so this help formatting is looking good now if you want the same formatting to other text also aapko wo same formatting baaki text ko bhi dena hai to sabhi ko select karo sabhi ko same sabhi option pe jao fir wapas se click karo ये सब करने से अच्छा है आप क्या कर सकते हैं यू कैन यूज फॉर्मेट पेंट ब्रश ऑप्शन ओके एंड टू डू दैट जस्ट क्लिक दैट फॉर्मेट पेंट ब्रश ऑप्शन के लिए पहले क्या करना है यू हैव टू सिलेक्ट दैट वर्ड जिसका फॉर्मेटिंग आपको कॉपी करना है एंड जस्ट मूव योर माउस ओके टू अपसाइड इन द सेकंड मेन्यू देयर इज अ फॉर्मेट पेंट ब्रश ऑप्शन एक ब्रश वाला ऑप्शन है यू कैन सी दिस फॉर्मेट पेंट ब्रश ऑप्शन आई विल शो यू दैट ऑप्शन okay so here you can see this brush wala option this is the option that we are going to we are discussing about so that option we will click on that option okay and when we click on that option the same formatting will be copied now uh, if you move your mouse pointer along with that ek chhota sa uh, automatically ek dotted uh, arrow is also mouse pointer is also ya fir uh, text pointer is also moving so what you have to do was uh, jo your mouse pointer will change to bucket tool 
सो यूजिंग दैट बकेल टूल वी विल सेलेक्ट द टेक्स्ट जितना हमें चेंज करना है उतना वी विल बी सेलेक्टिंग नाउ इतना हमने डेड लाइन और वन एंड हाफ लाइन वी हैव सेलेक्टेड एंड जस्ट रिलीज दैट एंड ऑटोमेटिकली यू विल सी दैट द सेम फॉर्मेटिंग इज बीन अप्लाइड टू दैट पर्टिकुलर लाइन व्हाट वी डिड व्हाट वी डिड फर्स्ट वी सेलेक्टेड दिस वर्ड हेल्प ओके बिकॉज़ that word we have changed or that word formatting we have changed so to apply other formatting we will go to the format paint brush option then we will select that complete text where you want to apply and just release that or we will release that agar aapne pura nahi chahiye if you want the same formatting for that particular word only so that also you can do you can just click and apply that formatting to that particular one word so automatically that boy has changed to the help all structure okay so this is the option that is format paint brush option we will go back to our ppt so this was about format paint brush option so what it says it copies the formatting of one section of a text ek section ka ya fir ek word ka jo bhi formatting hai that will be copied and it applies the same जो क्या करता है इट अप्लाइज द सेम टू अनादर टेक्स्ट ओके दिस इज व्हेन इट इज हेल्पफुल दिस इज हेल्पफुल व्हेन यू हैव अप्लाइड यू हैव टू अप्लाई दिस टू मोर देन वन फॉर्मेटिंग स्टाइल आपको एक से ज्यादा फॉर्मेटिंग स्टाइल करना है तो दैट टाइम यू कैन यूज दिस ओके यू कैन यूज दिस वन नाउ दिस वाज अबाउट फॉर्मेटिंग पेंट ब्रश ऑप्शन नाउ वी विल सी हियर द फॉक्स वर्ड वाज देयर the help ki tarah usko bhi humne kar diya hai now we will learn about editing a document now what is mean by editing a document so in your last delete text how to replace text copy and paste text also ye to humne already learn kar diya hai then what we are going to learn is how to check the spelling and grammar of your text or how to uh, see or how to find synonyms and antonyms for your text words that we are going to learn now you will say what is this synonyms what is this antonyms so that also we will be learning in detail over here so first we will learn about spelling and grammar check so spelling and grammar check why it is used spelling and grammar check so we will learn we will learn about checking and um, uh, checking spelling and your grammar mistake how to do that when you were in a class and when you were trying to speak with your teacher in english class and if you are doing some mistakes so your teacher was uh, correcting you beta ye nahi ye word use karo this nahi that use karo so likewise our open office writer also gives us an option using that option what we can do we can change the grammar and spelling mistakes of that particular line okay we can use uh, these options to change grammar and spelling mistake of your word now what happens suppose here we have typed a word that is buck big but we have typed it correctly but jo beech mein spelling dena hai jo beech mein space dena hai that we have not given so when your open office writer checks spelling jo spelling check karta hai so it takes it checks in two ways the red and the green when red line will appear that means uska matlab kya hota hai aapka spelling galat hai your spelling is wrong you have to check the spelling and if green line appears that means your grammar is wrong your sentence is grammatically wrong उसका जो फॉर्मूला होना चाहिए ग्रामर का दैट इज नॉट अप्लाइड ओवर देयर तो यू हैव टू चेंज दैट सो एंड व्हेन यू सी दैट रेड लाइन व्हाट यू हैव टू डू जस्ट क्लिक ऑन दैट वर्ड राइट बटन क्लिक करना है माउस का एंड यू विल सी द डिफरेंट डिफरेंट ऑप्शंस ऑफ दैट पर्टिकुलर वर्ड ओके जिस वर्ड का आपको चेंज करना है उस वर्ड के आपको क्या मिलेंगे ऑप्शंस वहां पे अवेलेबल ऑप्शंस आपको मिल जाएंगे दैट इज अबाउट योर checking spelling and grammar now next one when green line will come that means what is happening your spell uh, your grammatically that sentence is correct jo grammar ke formulas hote hai na us formula mein wo sentence 
बैठ नहीं रहा है दैट इज वाई इट इज इनकर इट इज शोइंग इट इनकर 